up for sale 1967 Corvette. I'm gonna walk around it, tell you about the car, fire it up, and then drive it. If you enjoyed the video, please give a like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more videos like this. Thank you. Like I said, 67 Corvette finished in red with red interior, 427 four speed, frame off restoration. And there's always, you know, go around it, tell you everything I do know about it, point out anything I do see, fire it up, and then drive it. So, of course, starting here in the front, as always, uh, again, just, just happy to have another C2 here, finally, after all these years. Now it's probably the third in a year and a half. And again, the King, 67 Corvette. Stinger hood, 427 in it. Red on red as well. Side pipes and the 67 knockoffs. Oh, my gosh. Um, it was frame off restored by looking at it probably 20 years ago. The way the paint is, you would think maybe, you know, far less than that. But anyway, you know, let's focus here just on the chrome, which is super nice. You see a couple little, I'm going to say water stains on it, but very, very, very nice. And same deal here. Uh, the quality of the paint is beautiful. Super, super nice. And let's just, you know, look down at it. The color is deep. And I got the sun out, which is nice. Head to plate door fitment is the way it should be. Now, I will say, you know, as always, there's a little check there, one check there, and then I know there's a little check right there, which again, is, it's going to happen. But that hood fitment's beautiful. I love the white stripe on the Stinger hood, too. Oh, my gosh. And a little, little check right there. Common stuff. But again, like I said, I'm going to point out anything that I do see as I'm going around it. Of the original body panels, you know, the bonding strips are in place. Let's go ahead. I want to open it. First off, just flash to the interior real quick before I open the hood. It's leather seats as well. And voila. 67 427 motor. You got CPP ma uh, master cylinder for the four-wheel disc brakes. Stock exhaust manifolds on there. A Holley carburetor on there. And just look how nice this whole engine compartment is. I, I have the stainless shielding actually over there, which was a with a bonus item I'm going to tell you about, but it kind of arcs the distributor and whatnot, so I just, I don't want to put it on. I just could, I'm just going to include it and show it. Uh, you know, radiator is nice. The fan is nice. You can see the new bushings in the control arms, how clean the inner fender wells are down here, all that. Um, just, just correct. The underhood is super, super nice as well. Anyway, going on to this side. I'll have the casting number down to show you what it is. It's been rebuilt. And the pad is decked, so it's at least a 390 horse. You know, the other ratio will be the 400, 435. I just assume it's a 390. Um, but yeah, yeah, I got a picture of the carburetor as well. See how nice that is down there. Even got like correct clamps on the hoses and whatnot. See how nice that control arm is. Really nice, really, really nice. You can see how nice this is too. This is new. Wiper motor looks new. You know, a lot of recent stuff. I mean, the coil looks brand new. But anyway, uh, what I have included for it is a tri-power intake, which over here, I'm just going to include it. I've, I've had this for about two years, waiting for the right car. I think this one deserves it. Uh, so, you know, winner's cast, 427 intake, tri-power with the, you know, original air cleaner, which, would, which for a 400, again, you throw a sticker on there, could be 435. But... That's included with it as well as the shielding. And that's just that's just the bonus, like I said. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll, I'll fire it up a little bit later on. Show it drive, get in for the driving. Uh, the greatest sound of all, your chambered side pipes. But anyway, focusing here now on the paint. Just beautiful, look at that. Uh, the fitment all the way around is the way you want it to be. The red on red with the red line is just a sweet combination. No cracks in the glass. The trim is super nice all the way around. The top is excellent, it's clean, there's no rips. It's always been stored up, so there's, there's no wrinkles on it. that real quick it is it is red leather the 
door panels like brand new. The seats are like new. Carpets like brand new. It's got black floor mats in there. Those are new. Of course, no rips on the seats. And they're firm. They're comfortable. Again, you know, when the leather starts to get old, it starts to, you know, get a little dry and, and uh, not as firm. But these are like super, super nice. Anyway, back out just a little bit. Correct steering wheel. The dash is beautiful. All the black is super nice. All the bezels for the gauges are new. Column, with exception for the little bit of dust on there. That's excellent. And the dash, look at the dash. The new pad, correct up there. Glove box door is nice. Working clock that you see there. You know, stock radio, nothing, you know, chopped up and put in. This whole section here is super nice as well. Stock shifter, again, you, you want. You know, no hearse shifter, you want the stock shifter. And just look at that. Nice visors. Normally I don't even show that, but they look great. And then just look at the top frame in here. It's been painted, it's been, you know, re restored, obviously, when the top was redone. Just show you the backs. Well, seat backs, awesome. Finish back there the way it should be again. Attention to detail. Bonding strip is where it should be, right about up here. I want to refocus my camera. There we go, there we go. Focusing on the back chrome bumper here. Really nice, really, really nice. The same there. And then you have your 67 back end here with the reverse lights in the middle. Which do work. I mean, and the sun is out and you're not seeing, you know, swirls on it. Like obviously well-maintained paint, really well-maintained. I mean, some of those little spider webs are just, you know, going to happen. Those little checks, you just can't avoid it sometimes. a couple of minor stone chips down there but just that again it's going to happen for the tire and look how nice this is down here i didn't show it on that side but this piece is super nice just identical to that see a little a little mark on the console sometimes you know that stuff's just gonna happen but it will be up for sale later today on my website nextgenclassiccars.com and ebay both links will be in the description of this video if you'd like to check it out and let us know uh you know comments questions We'll get back to you as soon as we can. 67 Corvette convertible. Finished in red. And just look how nice this is. Oh my gosh. With red leather interior. 427 Muncie 4 speed. Four wheel disc brakes. It's Michelin red lines too. Those are nice tires. Uh, again, 67 427. Tri power also included. And uh, yeah, we are just about to finish it up here. Fire it up and drive it. Thank you. All right, boss. 